this field is on gate. They're off along the inside HT. Aquila goes for the lead with the Alley Fighter alongside. From the far outside, it's Kearney Choice. Along the inside, Key One's Uno fourth. The outside, Redmond Lane fifth. Shadow Star six. Corey seventh. Furley is eighth. They go down the back stretch the first time. On the outside for the lead is Kenny Choice. Moving alongside now to challenge is Redmond Lane. Redmond Lane up on the outside for Billy Horton. He's got the lead at the quarter pole. Redmond Lane by a full length. Kenny Choice back to second. H.T. Aquila third. Gap of a length and a half. Valley Fighter pacing fourth. Key wins Uno fifth. Shadow Star six. Corey seventh. Furlease is eighth. They're about a quarter mile, 30 and two. At the top of the stretch the first time, Redmond Lane in command by a full length. Kenny Choice second. H.T. Aquila third. Alley Fighter moves to the outside fourth. They approach the grandstand in a half mile. Redmond Lane leads by a length and a half. Canny Choice is second along the inside. H.T. Aquila rushing up on the far outside is a shadow star. Half mile 102 and 4. Into the clubhouse turn the final time. Along the inside, Redmond Lane with the lead. Canny Choice maintains second position. Between horses, uh, that's uh, Alley Fighter third. Shadow Star the far outside fourth. H.T. Aquila fifth. Key wins Uno sixth. Corey seventh. And Furley's is eighth. Down the back stretch, the final time, they're all bunched up. Redmond Lane leads it by a head. On the outside, Alley Fighter second. Canny Choice maintains third position. Three quarters and one, 32 and four. Around the final turn, Redmond Lane with the lead. Alley Fighter on the outside second. Canny Choice is third. On the outside, Key One Zuno comes on a closer fourth. They're at the top of the stretch. It's Redmond Lane with the lead. Alley Fighter out in the middle of the track. The far outside, Key One Zuno. Redmond Lane along the inside. Alley Fighter closing on the outside. It's Alley Fighter.